to me that you still wanted to be a surgeon. You were just going to use a different tool. And I thought that was badass. I never want to say that I got into this to, to be a trailblazer or, or even to break a mold. I, I didn't want to change the face of welding. I just wanted to do what I did for a living and do it how I wanted to do it and be who I was and not compromise and not have to change myself or dress down or dress like a guy. I wanted to embrace my femininity and still get the job done. And that's really what it boils down to. Metal doesn't care what you look like. It doesn't care if I put eyelashes on for the day. It doesn't care if I'm a man, a woman, black, white, it doesn't care. It's the stigmas and the stereotypes and the myths and the misperceptions that keep people like you from pursuing these skills because they grow up watching TV and if they see a plumber, well, he's got to be a 300 pound dude with a giant butt crack. <laughs> right? He has to be. Has to be. So part of